Hi, I'm Dennis with Wise Auto Tools and on Ford three valve spark plugs that break in the uh, cylinder when you're trying to remove the, the spark plugs to change them, this is a common issue. Uh, for the last several years we've been selling the Lyle 65600 and this is a the Lyle and I'll show you this real quick. This kit here is, um, it uses a different method than Ford recommends. And uh, when we first started selling these, uh, these spark plug removal tools, uh, Rotunda was the only one that was available as a two-piece kit. Uh, used the method of removing the broken porcelain by basically loctiting a pin inside the porcelain and pulling the porcelain part of the spark plug out. So then you could use the second part of the tooling which would uh, make threads into the inside of the electrode shield and then pull that. Lyle uses a different method. Uh, they actually push the porcelain that's broken, they push it down a little further and then they're able to use the puller screw which is a self-tapping and um, now in most cases that works really well. We've sold a ton of the Lyle 65600s. Um, occasionally we will have someone that has a problem with the uh, puller screw getting dull after a few uses and on occasion we'll have someone uh, report that there is a broken piece of the porcelain that when they pushed it down it, a little piece went down into the cylinder so then they had to deal with that. Um, because of that reason or these reasons uh, we've taken another look at the Calvin version Calvin version of the uh, of the broken spark plug removal tools basically replicates the rotunda method. Um, you've got the first part of the tool which is the 39200 and this has the, uh, the tools in it that allows you to basically loctite the pin inside the broken porcelain and pull that out of the way and then once you do that then you can use the second part of the kit which kind of looks similar to the Lyle but this one is a little different rather than having a self tapping um, puller screw you first will use this tap you'll make threads into the electrode shield and then you'll use the second part of the tooling and you'll use that with the puller housing um, once you when you use this method this is basically the same as Ford like I said and you kind of eliminate the possibility of, of dulling the puller screw because you're using that tap to tap the threads into that housing uh, that's going to uh, be more of a sure thing uh, you, you don't have to worry about the tap getting dull or, or the puller screw getting dull because you're using that tap to make those threads initially and then the puller screw just has to go into the threads that are already made. Um, another advantage to this kit is that you are removing the broken porcelain. You're not taking a chance of it breaking the pieces and falling down into the cylinder. So we use both methods. We've sold both methods. Uh, I've actually used the Lyle method myself out in the field and uh, demonstrated the tool. It does work. Uh, in most cases you're not going to have any issues but we wanted to offer the Calvan as an alternative because um, it's just going to eliminate some of the risk involved.